here at AES 2013 on the Yamaha booth with Chris Henson, who's going to talk us through the new Arch system. It looks like it's going to be a challenge to talk about this in five minutes because it's a pretty impressive system. Yes, so. there's quite a bit to talk about in five minutes. So, what's the story, I mean, behind the whole project? It seems a very ambitious thing. It is, it is, but Yamaha and Steinberg have been working together to create uh, packaging products together since the early 90s or mid 90s when we first started offering audio sound cards for computer and we needed software compatible with the hardware. And in 2005 when Yamaha acquired Steinberg, uh, they always had a plan to do Yamaha hardware for Steinberg software. Okay. And through that, the development process, we've now ended up with Nuage. Nuage is a modular control surface and modular I.O. system for Nuendo 6 and Cubase 7. Okay, so if you can talk us through some of the feature sets, because again, it looks very, very sophisticated. Yes, well, we have got, uh, one of the things that was we strive for was to optimize the workflow from the hardware to the Nuendo software. So essentially what we do is we've eliminated the use of the mouse and keyboard for something like 95% of the functions of editing and mixing in the software. Uh, we have uh, a fader control, we have uh, encoder control, there's 32 touch sensitive controllers on a fader unit. We've got unique features like the touch slider that is, uh, allows me to shuttle through tracks uh, and find things. I've got a lot of navigation functionality for post-production that allows me to isolate particular tracks and show and hide tracks based on my uh, different editing functions at any given time, whether it be dialogue editing, sound effect editing, or uh, ADR and recording and replacement of dialogue. Hmm. So how about the I.O. capability? What have you got there? Well, this is based on the Dante Digital Audio Network. Yes. Uh, and with the AIC-128D PCI Dante card in the computer, I have the capability of doing 128 inputs and 128 outputs at sample frequencies up to 96 kilohertz. And presumably this doesn't support any other third-party software, it's strictly Cubase and Nuendo? Uh, it does Cubase, Nuendo, but there also is a basic QE protocol for the convenience of the customer to allow basic functionality in Pro Tools. So, when's this going to ship and how much is it going to cost? We're currently shipping. Uh, we started shipping about three weeks ago. Uh, the cost of the, uh, of you consider it from a standpoint of a basic editing system, uh, with the editor, the card, a 16-channel I.O., and uh, software, it's a ma manufacturer suggested retail of $18,000. For a basic mix system, which would be a fader unit, the card for the computer, uh, an audio I.O. and software, $19,500. Okay. And because it's modular, then I can scale it up from there. Okay. Thanks very much, Chris. Thanks for your time.